All right, everybody, I wanted to take a look at what Jalen Tolbert is doing versus the Bears. Uh, it's a third round draft pick for us so far. I think he has one reception for four yards on the season. And I wanted to kind of see in this game, uh, was it because he was our third receiver with uh, no run out, you know, was he not getting open? Was the scheme not suited for him? Uh, what was really going on? You know, is this on him, Dak, Kellen Moore? He got, you know, 46% of 43% of the snaps on offense. He had 25 snaps, according to NFL reference uh, or pro football reference. And uh, so it's not like he didn't have the opportunity or he wasn't out there. He was out there a ton. I'm not criticizing Dak's performance. I think if you saw it, you know, 21 of 27 with 250 yards and two touchdowns. Plus, we had 28 uh, points in the first half. But I do want to take a look at how Jalen Tolbert uh, was used. I'm going to show you every pass play that he was on the field where he ran a route. And so here we can see him at the top of the screen. So we're going to take a look at this first route. And you can see as soon as Dak makes the decision to throw the ball, um, he is not looking at him at all. He's looking at Gallup. Uh, he was looking at Gallup the whole way. And so he doesn't see the fact that uh, Tolbert runs a little slant curl here, finds a spot in the zone and stops. I think that's completion. Uh, maybe that linebacker pulls up on him if he's looking at him. Maybe not. Um, but uh, that could have been an option. Instead, he went to Gallup. Uh, and that's fine. I know they're trying to get Gallup, or it looked like they're trying to get Gallup involved uh, early on. All right, here we have Tolbert at the bottom of the screen. Uh, and he's going to have uh, some press coverage here. You can see that corner pushes him, and then he gets the release out. I think all that corner wanted to do was knock him off the original uh, route. I think he gets off of it decently. Uh, and Deck is looking over uh, on that side of the field. Uh, and he's looking at that side of the field the whole time. He feels a little pressure, runs out, and by the time Dak makes the decision to throw right about here, you can see that uh, I think Tolbert is covered by that corner and that safety, and so Dak goes to the underneath route. Um, there's not really yards after the catch to be made there, uh, but I do think that's the right decision. I think uh, that would have been a pretty tight window to try to fit that ball in. All right, next play. We have Tolbert at the top of the screen. Uh, he's got press man coverage. Uh, he's got a... Mm, similar to that first play, looks like a slant curl. I mean, Dak is looking at um, Gallup the whole way, but at the time he decides to throw it, he never sees any of, um, of Tolbert's route. Here we have Tolbert as the slot receiver to start, but we're going to send Lamb in motion, uh, which pushes some of the line away from him. And he runs a 10 yard out and actually makes his man stumble a little bit. Um, and so I think there is some yards to be had there. Uh, Dak, once again, never looks at his, his direction. And I think that's because Dak sees a touchdown uh, pretty much immediately as soon as uh, he looks at the safety. And we can see it from the other side a little bit better. Um, but we can see he goes in motion, ball is hiked, there's that little play action. Uh, Dak is looking straight at number four uh, and then checks over to the left. And if we see what was over there to the left at this point, it's that uh, that corner has outside leverage on a route that CeeDee Lamb is going to break in slightly on. Uh, and so that's a touchdown there. Dak sees it, uh, and we have a touchdown. Might have a touchdown either to him or Tol Tolbert, um, either way. Next play, uh, Tolbert is in the slot, uh, a little unusual, and so... Uh, we have what looks like just a seven, eight, nine yard curl. By the time Dak makes the decision to throw this ball, you know, he never looks at him at all. So, but I think he's open in that if he wanted it, uh, but Dak never looked his way. Tolbert, again in the slot. We're gonna have CD Lamb motion away from him. Uh, this I think is a good route, one that he probably won, uh, but Dak 
never looks his way. And you can kind of see a theme here. Uh, Deck is going to focus instead on CD Lamb the whole time, who's got these three sort of moves he's trying to make, like a bunch of little stutter steps here. Uh, and uh, Deck pump fakes to him. Now, if Deck goes away from him after this initial pump fake, assuming he has time, uh, you can see that Tolbert is breaking in uh, on his coverage man and I think has an inside route. Um, but Dak doesn't look that way. Instead, I think he feels some pressure and tries to get the ball out uh, and it is incomplete to CD Lamb. But you can kind of see, if we watch all the way through this, if you watch Tolbert, I think he's got his man beat um, on an in-breaking route there. Next play, Tolbert at the top of the screen. He gets out of the break slowly, and I think it's on purpose so he can get some rub action um, with uh, the tight ends man and his coverage man, because he sprints uh, his in route right here. And I think there is something there if Dak wants it. Um, you know, by the time he makes the decision to throw, uh, right about there. Uh, I think he has his man beat with inside leverage. Uh, instead, he goes with um, C.D. Lamb, who's just getting his break, and uh, we get a completion. Tolbert here at the bottom of the screen uh, is going to come in motion. And this is a weird one. He just blocks for a little bit and then releases out. Again, by the time he releases out, the ball's already uh, been thrown. Uh, and we have completion to CP land. Here we have the last play before the end of the half. Uh, Tolbert here at the top of the screen is gonna run, um, I think like a 15 yard curl, uh, and it's covered. And I don't think anything is there. Uh, Deck throws over the middle. Uh, I don't think CD Lamb is expecting him to throw there because it looks covered to him. Uh, and he slows down a little bit, uh, and because he slows down a little bit, the uh, ball is overthrown. Uh, on to the next play, there's four more plays. I guess he was only in for four pass plays in the second half. Of course, he didn't pass the ball a whole lot in the second half. Um, we have him at the top of the screen. Uh, this is a little uh, go route. It uh, looks like the corner is with him step for step. So he's not open there. All right. Here comes Tolbert on this uh, motion, and he's now the outside receiver at the top of the screen. He runs into a guy, uh, actually Tony Pollard's coverage man, who also falls down. It looks like he's trying to have a go route, but um, by the time he runs into that dude, uh, Dak has made the decision to throw the ball basically right here. So he's still recovering from um, that, and uh, Dak never looks his way. Uh, and has already decided to throw to uh, Gallup, and that is that play. This is a uh, play, it looks like there's uh, kind of the same thing going on on both sides of the uh, ball, uh, and I think Dak looks at it pre-snap, sees three defenders there at the bottom and only two at the top, uh, and, and focuses his attention to the two at the top. And so. Uh, we have, I think, a fixed screen, so I don't think Tolbert is supposed to get this ball here because uh, his dude fakes the block and then uh, runs his little curl or slant, and um, I believe Dak is either hit or the ball is hit when he releases, uh, and so the ball falls well short. All right, and then the last play, uh, Tolbert there at the top of the screen, we have uh, just basically four go routes. I, run, I used to run this play in Madden all the time um, and do the similar thing, throw it to the tight end over the middle. Uh, and uh, that is a big completion. If you look at what Tolbert is doing on this one, uh, there's really not anything he, uh, he's got there. He's uh, covered on the top unless he stops his route uh, which I don't think he's supposed to do. There, there's nothing really for him in that area. Uh, and so uh, Dak makes the read, goes over the middle, 
and we have a first down. So yeah, that's what Tolbert did. And uh, I think there was a combination of things. It feels like it was mostly um, the fact that Dak didn't really look his way, uh, which could be put on Kellen Moore or Scheme. Uh, there's definitely places where he was open uh, and, and also other ones where he was totally covered. Um, so a little bit of a nuanced uh, position, I think, but um, he, I thought he did fine. Uh, he just wasn't in one of the first two or three reads um, or it, maybe Dak didn't even get to the second or third read on some of these. Uh, you know, it looks like Dak had made a decision to throw to one area on several of these and never even uh, looked towards his way. All right, that's all I've got.